What's up YouTube and welcome back to another Hogwood Legacy And today we can continue where we left off in the last video um, Not expecting anything to happen but it's happened we fight uh, what they call it a giant stone monster thingy The guardian or maybe I don't know what it's called but yeah So we don't want to chit chat we got a lot of assignment a lot of quests but I do a lot of digging before I do the before I start recording. Okay. Um Okay. Sorry about that. Um yeah. Before I start recording, I do a little what do you call it? Housekeeping. Do a little thing sidetrack. Like this, I need to purchase a new upgrade for my broom. Um here I need to do something for get the new technique same as this and same as this I have to gather every single one of them to do it I have to do up camera and I have to gather more money for this side quest for purchasing a new upgrade for the broom lucky for you I already did everything before I start recording now I have this 150 grand and I level 19 Yep, and all of you, you know I got this again <laughs> Okay, we don't want to chit chat long. Let's just Teleport to where we need to go Because we have a uh, What ah, that's the wrong button um three side Three main quests we need to deal. First is over here, but I'm not gonna deal with this. We need to get go to the broom shop. Uh, if I know where is it? Oh, it is. Need to deal with you. So let's just fast travel here. Probably. Hogs meat. Here I come. All right. Ah, I forgot to change my ability. It's for grinding only purposes. Ah, okay. It's a grinding thing. I have to fight enemies to progress the to get the new abilities. Okay. You're back. Nice to see you again. First things first. Let's purchase a new upgrade. What are we looking for today? Because I have 140... 1,400... 1, grand. I don't know. So this need 1,000 grand. And that's how to... how I don't know how to get that. I still don't know how to do it, but yeah. Okay, we don't want to chit chat. Let's just purchase it. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Ow, oh, that's hurt so much. I want to purchase all of it, but I don't have any money. You know how hard to get some money. Thanks for stopping by. I must tell you, Arthur Vogsmead's been by the shop asking about rumors of a broom upgrade. Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade, more difficult to perfect than the last. I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another cause near Irondale that Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Oh, you'll consider it, won't you? What more can you tell me about the next course? It's just a jaunt from here, south of Oxmead. Beautiful mountain views. The course was designed to test flyer stamina. Some of your classmates mentioned they were headed there, eager to see what Imelda has in store. A bit surprising, considering many of them expressed reticence at the idea of racing against her at all. I hope that won't deter you, and you'll give the course a go. At least think on it. Seriously, I... I can get... Okay, okay, the glasses is... Sounds okay, as if okay, you're okay. really outdoing The glasses yourself. is giving me If I'm me able a to help, I will. Thank you. I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. Report yeah. back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the races. 
God damn it. Alright. I thought just purchased the broom and we forget about the goddamn thing. But no. Off to the races then. We have to race again. Is it far? Ah. Nice to learning. You don't need to use all the boosts. Just. You come to the wrong place, child. Sorry about that, sir. Here we are. Mr. Weeks wasn't wrong about the mountain views. If it isn't the fastest Ravenclaw. Yes, I am the fastest. What's this? Oh, money. Another stuff to sell. Good. Hello, Imelda. So, another trial? Of course it's another trial. And you'd better be taking part. Does this mean you've changed your mind about me? Well, you're a step up from the good-for-nothings who usually challenge me. Well, they sit around and hope to be the best. Yes. I put in hours of practice. No one sets records by wishing for them. And I need strong competition to stay on top of my game. Are you going to try to beat my flying record or not? Let's go. I'm ready to fly. Finally. Me and my a weird challenge. My weird glasses. Really weird actually. Alright. Again. This time don't screw everything up. I'm getting the hang of this. Come on, come on, faster. I missed it. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh, uh. I'd say that was acceptable. Oh boy. Oh boy, I cannot see, I cannot see, I cannot see. Can I beat that record? I don't know. Come on. Come on. Come on, faster, faster, bro. Ah, crap. Maybe because it's too fast. Um, missed it. I'm getting the hang of this. I'm not gonna make it, am I? I'm not gonna make it. Uh, now that's more like it. Not gonna make it. Ah oh, man. I'd say that was acceptable. Ah oh, god damn it. Okay. Seems my record remains untouched. I expected better competition from you. What do you say? Up for another go? A chance to avenge the honor of your house? That sort of thing? I'm ready to give it another go. Okay, Good. this time. Come on! Come on! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Me! 
Did anyone else see that? Whew. Made it. You always say, third time the charm. You've improved, I must admit. That was a bloody good run. Be careful. Earn a reputation for talent around here, and some people get put out about it. Sounds like you're speaking from experience. Yes, well, I am. Anyway, you didn't do abysmally. I can't deny that. But you'll not have the same luck on the South Coast course. Uh. You said your reputation for talent put some people out. Like whom? Hmm. If you must know, I've had to deal with jealousy from members of my own house. When we were first years, uh... Nerida Roberts and I spent loads of time on our brooms, pledged to fly every day. As my skill on a broom grew, rapidly I might add, Nerida suddenly didn't have time for flying practice. I tried to give her pointers, but she didn't have the natural ability I did. Clearly, she was jealous. Her thing spends all her time now dawdling by the lake, obsessed with mer people. Won't even learn to swim. I refuse to downplay my talents to coddle someone else's fragile ego. <sighs> anyway, I need to ready the next course. Stop by when it's ready, if you can handle it. Okay. We'll see, won't we? Till next time. I half expected you to back down. Rest on your laurels. See you at the South Coast trial. If you don't lose your nerve. God damn it, another race. To race this course again, visit the podium with the leaderboard, where you can start the race and check your time. Thank you, I guess. Is that done with the side quest? I don't know. Another successful flight. I should let Mr. Weeks know. Oh, and now you ask me to go back to Mr. Week. God damn it. Yeah. Fast travel here. Get closer. God damn it. I want to fast travel. It's closer. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Alright, Mr. I forget your name. I wonder what man. I'm done with the second trial. Back from your latest flight. I want to hear all the particulars. Good news, Mr. Weeks. Mr. With your Week. upgrade, I was able to set a new record at the Irondale course. Brilliant! I knew the upgrade had fantastic potential. How did your broom feel? It rides well. It does get a tad shaky at top speed, and the handle wobbles a bit when I hit a strong gust of wind. Ah, yes. Hmm, I see. I think I know how to address that. Thank you. I owe you one. If it means another upgrade, the pleasure's all mine. You sound as determined as I am to improve broom flight. It's a joy to have a collaborator like yourself. If I'm right, and I do hope I am, you'll be hearing good news from me soon. Okay. Thank you again, truly. Bro. Mr. Weeks and I do make a good team. Has there ever been a vampire worth knowing? Thank you, bro, I guess. I don't know the ugly. Help me or not. It's because I already dying and uh, not dying losing Okay, now for the next side quest Our assignment yes During the day, okay We're gonna use it. We're gonna learn a new spell But we need to teleport to Here We need to teleport. Okay, where is the class anyway? Up here. Step aside. 
Where's the class? Um, excuse me, where's the class? Still going up? It is. Travel broadens the mind. Where is the class? Huh? Am I at the right? I didn't see ahead of time how bored I'd be in divination class. Is this the class? What type of class is this? Professor, I don't know your name. What just happened? What is this class? Art and craft or what? I still don't understand. I don't get it. Professor is so knowledgeable. What is this class? Ah, uh, Professor? I hope those assignments were challenging enough for you. Oh, a piece of paper. Thank you. Professor, what type of class is this? I don't understand. Professor... I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very Onai. well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now. As you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious. Based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come, what do you see in your own future? Um, I see true. Okay, I don't know. I sense danger. I see power. I'm not sure. I can't get rid of this feeling of a coming danger. I see. Know that such omens are not damning if they can at least prepare us. And you are preparing yourself even now. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. What? Channel your magic towards your targets. What? 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 This is... This cardio... You this have it. Descend you. Now. Why not practice the new spell on the training dummy? Okay. So this is the class who can, what do you call it? Seize the future. Like, I don't know. Okay. All right. Descender. Excellent. I think you have it. <laughs> Okay. Now I, I don't know how many spell left. One, two, three, three, and four, five, and six. Six spell. Okay. Let's see if what 
Elf. What? Else. Okay, what quest? Uh, another assignment. The hand stop. And the uh, touring thing. Let's do this first. object downward and slam okay I get it um, now we need to go another class flight yes because this is connecting with the flight school and one the last assignment is go to the go to the what do you call it go to the greenhouse because there's one over there and then we can focus on the main main welcome back have you finished your assignment oh i missed that another piece of paper you guys can just pause and read the piece of paper just pause it before i press it really quick reporting back professor assignments all finished well done shows good discipline wisdom is a golden snitch as they say and you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard let us practice our restore momentum a charm, incidentally, created to stop Quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. What? Precise, deliberate movements. Okay, I see that. Come on. Come on. Ah, 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 crap. Okay, this time... Ah, it's supposed to do like that, not hit yourself with the bing bang. Ah, ah, okay, 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 I get Very it. Very good. I... Sorry, sorry about that, professor. Need to test this. Just two must three. One, two, and three spell left. Eh. Six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Practicing your new spell as much as possible. Arrest the momentum. That's it. Keep it up. Arrest the momentum. Oh. It's more like it. <laughs> exactly. But yeah. Um. Quest. I get them. Quest, quest, quest. One last assignment. Return. Okay. Um. Now we go to the greenhouse. Where is the goddamn greenhouse? Here. Let's go to the greenhouse. <sighs> you can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Ah. Uh, okay, not here. Is it another... Right here. Yeah. Professor? Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. I've finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn Flipendo? 
Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. They mingle. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing is more than knocking back Flip the corner bendle. when okay. all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Yes, that's easy. Flip bendle, flip bendle. Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to... Sorry about that, Professor Garlic. ...in the greenhouse. Just mind the plants, please. Okay. Rependo. Oh, level 20. The the knockback jink. Reflect repend Rependo. Okay, now we just Okay. Well, now we have one, two, three, four, and five more. Fine, but yeah, that's all the assignment we have to do. Now, now for the main part. Now we can focus on the story. Okay, first thing first, we need to see Professor Fix. Where else is it? Uh, oh, not Professor Fix. Okay. Let's focus on this. Where do I have to go? Outside of Hotwood? No, no, that's not that far. Not that far, right? Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Thank you, I guess. Alright, let's go. I don't know where this is taking me, but... I want to learn a, a ability that can unlock... Unlock... I call it unlock some notch. Hey, professor. And I forgot to tell you, I already, I, I already opened this door. That here is a, a difficult, not so difficult, but have the new, new math. Ah, okay. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, a Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. Mr. Moon. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not! Uh, um, from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Okay. If you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Okay. Oh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed, which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now and I'll explain more as we walk. Uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart. 
or, or shapeshifter, if you will, mm -hmm. uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. Okay. This one took the form of a demigod. A demigod? <gasps> yes. Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demigods. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Some jackanapes use the boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? Yeah, why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. I'd be happy to help. I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However will you get in? Hmm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh! I sense you're a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> And I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. Oh, new spell. Alohormora. Um, how? Oh, yeah. Yes, that almost got me, but yes. Ah, we learn a lockpick. Okay. Hello, Hamora. Hello, Mahora. Hara. Okay, how 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 this works? Uh, still don't get it. Oh, I see. Ah, ah, ah. I'm still learning, but... Well done! You're in! Remember, use a disillusionment charm so no one claps on Okay. I guess we have to use this. This is a restricted area of the castle, after all. Thank you for noticing me. God damn it. God damn it, Chuckles. It's been a long time. We not. It's not been a long time. It's been a while. We not do some stuff, big stuff. Not have time for you, man. God damn it. Sorry, bro. I don't have time for you. I need to focus on the test. Indeed. Let's follow my field. Poorly, I'd say. Is that so? She. We're raising a generation. This is more exciting because we can just lock pick our way into the forbidden door that I oh, cannot open. This must be the prefect's bathroom. 
Alohomora. Okay. Yes. Damn it. Prefect. If the ministry would allow them to have wands, one of those goblins comes near me. I'll hand him his hat or helm. Anyway, I'm not afraid. Got one. Now we need to get out of here. That class is for. She's right. Why don't you leave goblins alone, troll? How dare you speak to a prefect that way? I'm a prefect too, twit. That's it. Fifty health points. Aloha, Mora. You know I'm supposed not to do this. Come on. Hey. Not supposed to do that. <gasps> I almost got myself cut. But. Preliminarily I should upgrade my. Ah that's why. I forgot I already learned a new, got a new, what do you call it, talent. It's a good idea to use it. God damn it. It's a good thing I use it. For this occasion only. Not at the moment, no. Plenty of other perils and pitfalls to send them my way, though. Well. God damn it. I had planned to bet a few galleons on Hufflepuff this season. Come on. Hufflepuff? Come on, 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 come on. This is when in the morning I think gonna be different, probably. In the morning, actually, this is at night. If we need to sneak around in the restricted area. I see something. Revenue. I see something. But I don't have time for that. Maybe later. Damn it. What are you doing here? Come on. I don't have time for you, my little friend. Maybe later, maybe later. Let's go. We're almost at. Almost there. Woo. Hello, Mr. Moon. I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh, goodness! You're as fearless as I'd hoped. An excellent start. Uh, if we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course, I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxmead, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. I'd be glad to help. I have the time, but I make sure I make no promises. It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. Uh, you, my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar. And I have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. You mentioned offering something in exchange for my assistance. I did. Uh, once you've brought me enough moons, I'll show you even more powerful forms of Alahamora. Not 
every lock is as easy to pick as the faculty towers. Okay. How many statues are there to find? I don't know precisely, but I've spotted dozens. God damn Things it. Seems are everywhere I look. You have your work cut out for you. If you were to ever unravel their meaning. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. Oh, and I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Okay, now we have two more quests. Okay, two more quests. Hmm. This got to do with the new technique. Okay, now where do we need to go over there? Ish. Okay, but what well, else? Another. Ah, now this become a side quest. Ah, uh, but I'm not gonna counter this. <laughs> I need to be precise. It's gonna become a side quest, okay? This. I don't know the meaning of it, but let's go to the hot meat. Maybe something good, I guess. Wow. At least we gonna and end here I come. End with something, right? now okay is it inside this oh you hello there nice to see you sirona hello miss ryan miss i ryan. wanted to thank you again for your help with rookwood and harlow the day of the troll attack sirona please and i was happy to help oh, those two are nothing but trouble glad you and your friend were here when they found you I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. <sighs> He's a friend. Um, I'm glad to hear that. It seems as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards, even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Okay. What have you heard about Rat, Rat Rock and Rockwood? Have you heard what Ran Rock and Rockwood are working on together? Not much more than the fact that they seem to have some sort of uneasy alliance. Friendship between wizards and goblins is rare enough, but between those two, they each want something the other has. I can guarantee it. That said, I fear they're like a two-headed serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. Okay. Are you worried about Rockwood? You seemed unfazed by Rockwood and Harlow the other day. They don't scare you. They're bullies. Plain and simple. Never tolerated them in my own life, and certainly won't tolerate them going after my friends. 
Don't misunderstand me. They're dangerous wizards and shouldn't be trifled with. They should, however, be confronted and reminded, whenever possible, that the rest of us have each other's backs. Thank you. Thank you, Serona. If you find Lord Gog, please give him my best. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, watch your back. Thank you, ma'am. I still don't know what to say because... Yeah, I don't know what to say. I don't... I, I, I just... I should shut up. I should shut up, yeah. I should shut up. Outside the castle. You too, I'll meet. Welcome to the Og's Head. Any empty seat is yours. Revelio. Mine now, dummy guys. I see something in the back. Can I get it? Why walk so slow, bruh? Oh! The, the moon thing. Good. Get hard to track. I will... If something to do, I will do off camera. To get... Gather all the goddamn thing. Because I never gonna know which... Where to Hello, find Lord it. Gok. Sorona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No. Actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am. And I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to, so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Don't know not trust me. Sorona trusts me, and she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serona trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back, the relic could well repair the chasm between us. I retrieved the uh, scrap. Very well. Relic. I'll retrieve the relic if you relic. promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need and meet me near the witch's tomb. Okay. Alright. So we gonna go to the big adventure here. New instruments are expensive, you know? Okay. Not, 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 not gonna... Not gonna give you a tip. I don't have any money, I'm gonna give you a goddamn tip. Okay. Just follow the, the dot line. It's a big adventure here. Okay. Bro. Sometimes it seems. I'm ready. Good. There's no time to lose. Where's the relic? I get in and get out. What precisely is the relic I'm to retrieve? A valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Urtgot. The witch considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she caused the goblins. Goblins believe that the rightful owner hey. of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Wizard kind see things differently. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. The differences between our kinds are myriad. They seem to be. It may surprise you to know that I do not believe those differences always to be insurmountable. It is the reason I find myself traveling with you to this tomb today. Mm-hmm.
So any more you're gonna say? Nothing? Nothing at all? At least say something. Yeah, then I think I have to go to in another to uh ancient ruin again. Why? Why you walk so slow? Come on, we burning daylight here. We got another schedule to do. Come on, walk faster, brother. Up. Oh. Don't tell me you have to follow me around. God damn it. If you want to run, you run with me. Ah, and there it is. The witch's tomb. Dreadful looking place, isn't it? I know this place. This is the place that I've been exploring. I've been seeing this place. I know this place is gonna be something. I wish you luck retrieving the helmet. As a wand carrier, you should have an advantage. Now, before you set off, do you have any questions? A lot of questions, actually. Why is this helmet valuable? What about this helmet makes it so special? The helmet of Urtgot is an ancient and storied relic, forged during a time of unity among the goblin clans. It inspired greatness, that is, until it was no longer ours. Then it became something else. A symbol of what has been lost, of all that wizard kind has taken from us. Reclaiming it would mean a great deal to goblin kind and to Ranrock. He would be grateful to me should I return it. Do you know why Ragnarok is working with Ragnarok? It seems Ranrock and Rookwood are conspiring. Rockwood. Why would that be? I had heard this. When the dark-hearted conspire, they seldom make their full intentions clear to one another. I can only speculate, but I imagine their alliance is uneasy and quite fragile. Let us hope that ours is less so. Okay. What might encounter in this tomb? Don't suppose you have any idea what could be waiting for me inside the tomb? Considering a dark witch was involved, I suppose there's a chance you may encounter the dark protectors, known as Inferi. The foul creatures thrive on darkness and the cold. Vanquish them with light, force, and most effectively, fire. I'm ready. It all seems clear to me now that we're here. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. So this is gonna be a comeback I again. Sorry about that, brother. Okay, this is gonna be another comeback. So I have to be prepared for anything can come to me. Okay. Into the tube again. Man, I have... I don't like going to the tube every time because <laughs> we can I don't know we're gonna suspect what we're gonna fight the place is really it's sealed mm, don't tell me um Lumos. I think there is one more. Rebellion. I thought so. But how? Ah. Wrong button. Moths. Curious. Don't curious. I already knew. All right. Go in your home, my little one. Okay. Before that, this place is dark as hell. 
Alright. Alan's bed. Nothing. Rebellion. Got some stuff to sell. Got some money. Okay, I don't see this, don't see anything. This place is big as hell. I think I have to use Lemos. This can't be the witch's tomb. Likely I need to go further. I need to news you again. Lumos. Got money. Got money. Okay, how? Hmm. I think I know what to do. I need you. Also. Ah, I know it. Ah, I see. Lumos. Oh, one is already go in. I don't see that. Oh well. It's a good thing. And collect thing. The thing that I can use to make my potion. Good, 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 good. So far, we not attacking anything. So I have a feeling I'm not alone here. Ah, now it's time for combat. Um. Yep. What the hell? What the hell? Expelliarmus! Confringo! Defender! Come on! Come on, come on, come on! Expelliarmus! Confringo! Oh boy! Yeah. Incendio! Get it! Incendio! Come on, come on, come on, come on! I need to watch that. Oh, need to burn them. Okay, now I see. Uh, that's not supposed to happen. I need to burn them. Alright, alright, alright. Alright. Okay, this is gonna be a problem because they they don't affect with what they call it normal magic. So my best bet I have no idea. My best bet is using fire. Or Kafango, that's the only bet I can think of. Hmm. Revelio. Okay. Lumos. Stay there. Where is the last one? Figured it out, bro. I figured it out. Now we just Lumos. need you to follow me. Oh. 
Open the door. Okay, before you open the goddamn again. Alright. Well, it take time, but we figured it out. We figured it out. Slowly, my jelly. Man. What's that hanging there? Looks precarious. Down I go. No other way. Bro. That is a lot. It's sealed shut from the other side. Good. Give me a material. Wingardium Leviosa. I need to remember I have that magic. New Slash. New Slash. Okay. Okay, there is nothing else. I think we're going down again. I don't know how long in this place, but we will try. We will try. All right. Ah. Rebellion. Oh, oh. God damn it. Incendio, Expelliarmus, Confrigo. Oh boy. Protego. Oh boy! Come on! Incendio! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh boy! Incendio! Ah! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh boy! God damn it! Expelliarmus! Incendio! God damn it! 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 Expelliarmus! Defender! Incendio! Confringo! Oh boy! Incendio! Come on, burn! Burn! God damn it! Burn! Expelliarmus! Oh boy. Can I use this? Oh boy. Oh boy. Incendio. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Wow, 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 wow. I should. Damn the beast class first before I deal this. Oh well, it doesn't matter. We uh, we did it on the guard, but who cares? Okay. Revelio. Now we need to find the butterfly. Am I that stupid or what? Lumos. Am I that stupid or what? Am I that idiot? Am I that idiot? The answer is yes. Come on, open the door. How far we- Which is final resting place? Lodgok said the helmet was in her sarcophagus. A dead Ashwinder. Your compatriots must have made off with the helmet. Lord Gok won't like this.
Before I collapse that Rebellion. Anything else? No Yes Yes, there is money Wow Money Better show this to Logok I know there's a mechanism to open this door Can you auto teleport me to outside please? Because going here is stupid and painful. Make my head hurt. I will never come here again. Talk to you. Lord Gok. Lord Gok. The sarcophagus had been raided. I found no helmet, only a dead Ashwinder. Damn, they got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to Ranrock. I saw one of their campsites not far from here, but I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. Very well. I'll head there now. Good. There's no time to lose. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. To think those wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. Yeah. Rare. Just down here, right? Please. Come on. Let's go, me boyo. If we're done with this main quest, I think we can go to the... There they are. The Ashwinders. Oh. That was hey. a Okay, buddy. Bobo. Come on. Oh boy. Oh boy. Come on. Whoa. Come on, come on. Knew you were still hanging Come on, come on, come on. I don't thank you, you guys, bro. Oh boy. I need to get rid of you guys. You guys can get. Oh! Bro, bro, bro! Come on, come on, come on! Bro, 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 bro! Bro, 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 wait! Okay, bro. Come on, 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 come Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, hey. God damn it. You are such a pushover. One last foul hulking brute. Are we done? Am I accidentally come here? On purpose or I really don't understand anything but that's it yeah this is for Rookwood I'll watch the light go out of your eye incendio you're the one who really <laughs> Whoa, whoa. You need to get away from me, bro. You've made a 
Why oh, I forgot I can do that? Why oh, I forgot everything? But first, yes. God damn it! I'm using all my stuff. God damn you! All right, let's do this. Go to the goddamn thing. Nothing. Let's see what do you call it. The goblin. There's no telling what lies in wait for me in there. No need because we don't want to go that inside anymore. I retrieved the helmet from the Ashwinders. Well done. This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile, remarkable. It's stunning. It looks stunning, Lodgok. I see why you wanted it back. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. Ah, then I am glad to be rid of it myself. Thank you. This should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me greatly, friend. I am glad that I trusted you. We shall speak soon. Best to keep our arrangement quiet for now. Many will not believe that our aims might possibly be aligned. Okay. Okay, time to your time class. Time to attempt the class. So we gonna fast travel to the class. I should do this first before I slumber against the goddamn thing. <laughs> Ah, ah. Okay, let's go. And after this, I think I need to do what we call it off camera looting. Because I'm running out of supply. I need to go back to my room of requirement to get more supply. I think this is just a normal class, so let's just do that. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, the class is really far. Can I attempt the class? That's what I'm trying to say. Because after doing all of that quest, take time. Take time. I hope I can, what do you call it, attempt this class. Why I teleport so far away? If it is. <laughs> okay. Why I teleport so far away? And I don't know where's the goddamn class anyway. So yeah. I should teleport different location. God damn it. Yeah, it's the other side of the school. The other side. The other side of the school. I think I have to wait until I can, what do you call it, attempt the class. Because it's night time. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, the class is really far away. 
What type of class is this? What type of class? I really know because it say beast. It's a beast class, but I don't know what type. What it gonna offer me? Oh oh oh. Where am I going actually? Don't tell me the outside. If it outside, I'd be stupid. Yes, it's outside. God damn it. The one place that I want, want to come. The last place, the very fast place. I can just teleport here. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented Wait. <sighs> God damn it. I should teleport here. God damn it. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. I don't want to know what you can it practice do. on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. You can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. Oh, that's new. Oh, that's new. That's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beef? Ah, uh, that's new. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? This way. The measles are over here. Wow. Oh, couple of measles whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jukes. <laughs> Stupid thing. Is that a cat? Yeah, it's a cat. What in Merlin's name are you doing? Ugh, tuss tuss, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her name is Persephone! <laughs> Her name is Persephone! <laughs> That's really not funny. Yeah. <sighs> Let's go. Don't laugh with... Ah, well, I don't know what to say. 
It's a good feline. It's a cat. Uh, Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Poachers in training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Yeah. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. Yes, I know that. Okay. Time to get some yum yum. Here's some yum yum. <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. Come on. Come on. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourself now. Wait, 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 Professor. Before we done with the this, let me do my routine, daily routine. Um. Okay. Here. You are a big cat. You are a big good cat. All right. Okay, Professor. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast lesson? Uh, enjoy it. I enjoy it. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer, stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps? Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. Thank you, Professor. Hey, over here. Come on. What is it? What is it? Do you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. Sound interesting. You've intrigued me. Very well. Lead the way. I'd hoped I would. Okay, can you... Uh, I wouldn't take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you. I think. Yeah. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. Yeah. Actually, I want to know what that gerbil do to you. <sighs> Quite the weather we're having, don't I you think? I think I know, but I don't Bobby, want to where say. Where are you taking me? It really is much better. I know I what that beast do to you, but I don't want don't to say worry. it. We're nearly there. It's just ahead. Okay, but I don't want to say it. <laughs> I really know what they do, but I don't want to say it. Stand back. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Yes. It's a flying wyvern. Please meet High Wing. High Wing? Isn't she just magnificent? Go on, introduce yourself to her. But be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. 
Um, hello? Um, I'm, I'm a friendly, friendly person. Hello? Can you understand me? Oh. Wow. I'm a good person. Wow. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. Okay. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring her pasties, tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. Yeah. Neck, neck. Eat up, eat up, eat up. Good little one. That's a good little... Not little, big. Big bird. Someday I will ride you like a horse. It's a bird slash horse slash thing. I don't know. So, what did you think of High Wing? High Wing? Mm, she was brilliant. I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hippogriffs? Mm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Ah, oh, that's it. Got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again, and that I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seems to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. The poachers' influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. That sounds serious. That Surprising. does seem strange. Strange. Sounds as if they're planning Surprise. something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. Would be good to investigate. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Highwing safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. Okay. God damn it, I almost saw. Anything else before I end? Because you guys. Hello, friend. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks when you can. I'd uh, like your help with something. I know it. As I mentioned, my sister Anne misses Hogwarts, and she hasn't been herself lately. I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her with me. I'm heading to Feldcroft soon, so I'll look forward to seeing you there. It's just south of Hogwarts. By the way, hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. Any more? Now that you've attended Beast's class, I've asked Deke to assist you in using the room to further your studies in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. Wait. I've not heard from my Uncle Roland in quite some time. I've been beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the courtyard? Any more? I think not more. Okay, okay, okay. Before, before I tangle... Before I end the video, because... I hear something about Dick. I hear something about Dick. Yes, meet with Dick. Um. Yeah. Wow, a lot of stuff to deal with. Yeah. I think let's before we end the, the goddamn video I think we need to speak to Dick first then we we are malware because 
if there could uh, evolve with dig that means the room requirement we get a new thing okay uh, where is it yes okay now we need to go to the room of requirement not like that you got a vessel and this just teleport here it's very faster before i end the video before i end the video okay because yeah two hours is not that long check with dick okay because we attempt beast class that means one thing i've been researching that mean one thing because I want to end myself in this place. It's really good. And next time I will get more supply again. Deke. Ah, Deke is so happy to see you. Deke noticed this bag in the room the other day. You must need it to help with your schoolwork. Deke has seen one of these before. Deke calls it a knapsack. Thank you, Dick. Perfect for gathering and transporting beasts. <laughs> Pleasant little breeze. I have been thinking about something Professor Howen said in Beasts class, that I should study as many beasts as I can on my own time. She also mentioned that poachers have been active in the area. So, perhaps the beasts will be safer with us than out on their own. Precisely what Deke was thinking. You see? The room knew exactly what you needed, and luckily, Dee can show you how to best use the knapsack and where. Come on, Dick. I don't have time, Dick. Come along then. Our first stop will be beyond the castle grounds. We can leave now. Come and find Dee when you're ready to go. I'm ready to learn how to use the knapsack. Perfect! Deke loves an outing. Okay, before we end, two hours is not a bad chase. Just catch a random monster, maybe. Just need to learn it. And we call it a day. For once. A nasty poacher. Deke hated working for him. He did horrible things to beautiful beasts. Oh. It was during those days that Deke first saw a knapsack. Uh, it'll be nice to see one used for good. Up a fuff. Okay, how to use it, Deke? We have arrived. Deke enjoys coming here to watch the beasts, especially the puffle of puff skeins nearby. It will be nice to keep them safe. All you will need to do is get close, direct the open knapsack toward the puff skein, and in it'll go. All right. Ow. Oh. Don't do that. Okay. Okay, that's not good. Do cooperate, won't you? Okay, how do I do this? Oh, I forgot. You got one. I forgot. I I'm using the uh, Xbox controller. I managed to rescue a puff skin. You can rescue as many as the knapsack will hold. Poachers capture puff skeins and, well, Deke isn't sure what they do with them. Uh, Deke is certain they will be safer with you. Now, not all beasts will be as simple to rescue as a puff skein. Deke suggests you next find a beast that can fly. A job and all, perhaps. All right. Where would I find one? Deke knows of some to the west, nesting in a large tree overlooking Hogwarts. But we must be careful. Deke has seen poachers in the area recently. Deke will meet you there whenever you're ready. I'm ready, dude. God damn it. 
God damn it. Okay. Two hours long is not not that far. Not that hard. At least we done something. I just want to get this thing done. Because it's unlocked a new thing in the the room of requirements so I can Okay Deke. Hello Deke. Shall we continue? Oh good. Deke was worried about you, what with all the poachers in the area. Perhaps we should work quickly. The jobanals are just here in this large tree. If it's helpful, Deeg has seen Levioso used to slow flying beasts. Easier to get in close and use the knapsack. Okay. Then I shall go and rescue a job and all. Good luck. Deeg will be waiting. Uh, Levioso. 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 Okay. Arrest the momentum. Settle yourself. I mean you no harm. That's simple enough. I almost make a wrong error. I rescued a job and all. Deke hopes your job and all finds the knapsack nice and cozy. Poachers want them for their feathers, and are not kind when they gather them. Are there any other beasts nearby? Just one that Deke knows of, a herd of moon calves. They live in a clearing of trees up this footpath. Deke will see you there. Deke! I don't know, Deke. <laughs> you know what, I can fly. It's not that really far away actually, but oh well. The stop magic is good. What are you up to now? Nothing. Hello, Deke. Is this the clearing you mentioned? It is. Moon calves gather near the large tree with the spiral pattern in front, but only under the light of the moon. So. Unfortunately, unless you have a way to hasten time, you might sometimes have to wait until nightfall to see them. How did you end up at Hogwarts after working for your former master? Deke's prior master had no family, so when he died, all of his house elves were relocated by the Ministry. Deke was the most fortunate one as Deke was sent to Hogwarts. Deke's friends were not as fortunate. Okay. I shall go and find a moon calf then. Deke will be waiting for your return. God damn it. So if animal is paw prints. Okay. Oh, I need to change the night. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Wait. Ah. Arrest the momentum. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, get in. You are a big little fella. There, there. I'm not going to hurt you. You want big fella. Big fella. Dick, I get uh, the thing. It was a bit trickier than the others, but I have a moon calf now. Another beast, safe and sound. Shame we didn't see the moon calves dancing. It's a marvelous sight. Dick supposes you're finished here. Yes. You'll be able to rescue many more beasts, but for now, let's bring the ones you've gathered back to the room. All yes, right. that's what Deke I really... will meet you back in the room whenever you're ready. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it, dick. Deep. 
I have to do this again. God damn it, dick. Okay, let's go. The room of requirement, right? <laughs> and after this done, I think we can call out call it a day. Yeah, call it a day. Okay, Dick, what is Dick it? Dick hasn't seen Dick. this many. There you are. <laughs> now we need to show the beast you rescued their new home. But, um, not enough room to let them out here. Imagine all those beasts running amok. That wouldn't do at all. Don't worry about it. Perhaps if you focus on what your beasts need, the room will provide. Mm. Hmm. What exactly did you think of? What is it? Deke isn't sure. Only one way to find out. Meet you inside when you're ready. I always ready, bro. Wow. Wow. Look at this. It's amazing. Where are we, Deke? It seems to be a place for your beasts to live, a vivarium of some sort. Oh, your beasts will be quite comfortable here. They'll live healthy, safe lives. Perhaps you want to release them, let them see their new home. How do I release them? That RB? Oh. All right. <laughs> oh. Deke thinks the vivarium will be a fitting new home for your beasts. Indeed. I only hope we'll have enough space for all of them. Deke hopes so too, but if you do run out of room, Madam Peck at Brood and Peck in Hogsmeade will help to find safe homes for them. Any beasts that the room can't hold? Yes, she's well known for helping to care for beasts in need, and she'll give you a fair price for them. Speaking of care, beasts that are well fed and groomed will provide you with valuable magical materials, such as puffskin hair, for example. If you gather some magical materials from your beasts, Dee can show you how to use them. Very well. I shall let you know when I have some. I guess... That's it. Or maybe... Supposed to do this first. Wonderful! Ah... Oh. Here. Snacky snacky. Come on, come on, hurry up. Collect. Okay, that's done. Where's my other two fellow? Yo, bro. Come on. I think this. <laughs> take a little too long <laughs> exactly but it's a good thing we're learning a lot one thing where is my other one hello mooncake 
Moon Calf Moon Cave. Here, take this. Yum yum. Okay, time to see dick. I hope this is done. Because I really tired. I've collected some magical materials, Deke. Now, Deke can show you how to use them. First, you'll need to use this spellcraft to conjure an enchanted loom. An enchanted loom? Exactly. It will allow you to Ooh, use your magical spread. materials to weave magic into the very threads of your clothing, making your clothing more useful in a variety of ways. Why don't you try it? Deke thinks you'll be impressed with what the loom can do. I'll go and experiment with the loom now. Is it the thing? Okay. Huh? 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 What? And wait, 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 what? Um, got them. Ah, uh. um, here would be nicely. Okay, what do I have to do? Ah. So. Okay, we need example. You will be my example. Or. I get it. Ah, it's a great station. Okay, I get it now. At Arrest the momentum. Sorry, wrong button. I have to do something. This will be more useful when I have something to identify. I don't have enough stuff. I should show Deke. Okay, now we talk to Dick. I use the enchanted loom, Deke. Wonderful! Will I be able to weave even more powerful magic into my clothing with the loom? You will, by rescuing even more powerful beasts. For now, however, Deke suggests you explore the vivarium and get to know the beasts you've already rescued. Can I use the loom to enhance any item of clothing? The loom will only enhance clothing of a certain quality. Deke suspects you'll find more valuable clothing as you explore. Deke also knows that some of the shops in Hogsmeade can provide you with a variety of clothing for you to enhance. Okay, thank you, Deke. Thank you for your help, Deke. And we're done with that. We're done with everything. We unlock a lot of things, we rank to level 21! Before I end any message out or something gonna interrupt me? I guess no! Okay guys, we're gonna end there! Wow, that was a decent 
Gameplay, we learned a lot of thing today. We learned how to catch bees and we have a old friend at the bar and we explore a tube and some kind I don't know. And the first the best part is we learn the be the we learn how to pick pick a lock lock pick lock pick a room and yeah we learn how we upgrade our broom to the, another upgrade i don't know that's affect anything but i, I don't know and we can we unlock uh, a beast a beast a beast what I call it home at the room of requirement and yeah i guess that's it and i guess I will do a little scabbing before not nah, before after in the next video I think I have a lot of I need to prepare for for the next recording so yeah I guess that's it if you new here yeah, subscribe to my channel if you already subscribe good for you and always I will see you in the next video peace bye 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 bye